Hello everybody, Garner here with a team for Garnet's Intersecting Wills. I'm going to bring Ace with his base BT, uh, Beatrix, and Dash. And yeah, this team has a pretty good time about with this, I guess. Yeah, because Dash is definitely more on the defensive side, even though he does have a lot of enchants going on. Oh yeah. Oh, Beatrix. Yeah, I haven't really used her ever since she got her updates. I don't know why. I just haven't. Okay, what am I doing? Hang on to that. Gonna eat X with him. Okay, they're all decently shaved down, and I'm going to go ahead and just use Shelk's Call right away. I don't know why I can pick somebody for this, since I'm pretty sure it only affects the person calling it, but whatever. I don't know, maybe it's a bug. Um, right, yeah, I did that just so I can get her a Climb Hazard. Climb Hazard? I have no clue what that word is. Anyway, I just wanted to get that up so I can get Holy Knight's Safeguard up and going. And now it is Ace's turn. Ace's turn. Yeah, we're just going to put up that call right away. But yeah, Shell Call. Pretty handy, because uh, if you put it on like a slow character, like Beatrix has like a slow charging EX, it's just immediately up and you don't got to worry about the recast as much. I think it's also pretty handy if you do it with like Garland. But then again, he doesn't start with his overhead, so it is a little bit annoying, but whatever. Oh yeah, and thanks to Ace's off-turn damage and the fact that he's enchanted, uh, the orb really isn't an issue. Beatrix also, also is helping, but it's kind of excessive, honestly. Um, Alright, these guys like to do a lot of physical attacks, so I'm going to stick with Plasma Stroke. And also, it has Splash, so like, I think it just does more damage. Alright, I'm going to put up her LD again. Oh yeah, A is paralyzed thanks to Dash, but that's not going to change too much. Sure, I am missing out on a Rose Petals, but uh, I feel like most of the damage here is coming from Ace. Okay, so they're at, uh, where is this going? Oh, okay, just immediately going next. So now I can just drop blind stud on them again. Oh, yeah. Uh, let me see here. Why wouldn't I do this? It's pretty ridiculous. Uh, Dash is still going. Oh, right, I gotta use his LD. Uh, da, da, da. Looks like she lost her defense buff, but I don't really care about that. Okay, uh, game slowed down a bit there.
You know, in hindsight, I probably should have hit the paralyzed one because it's not going to get hit with the rose petals. Let me see here. When am I going to swap out Beatrix? Because that is who I'm swapping out, because I want Desh's uh, Thunder Enchant. I think sometime after they do their next Sandstorm. And I feel like this is just going to be a preview of the Shiva fight, because boy, they are taking a while to do their stuff. <sighs> There's just a lot of stuff going on in the off turns. Beatrix definitely isn't helping with that. Ah, uh, you know what, screw it. I think on Beatrix's next turn, I'm actually just going to bring in the twins. I would, I want her to cleanse the debuffs, but uh, honestly, I, I don't really care. <laughs> Alright, so let me toss up Jack. Cause I'm gonna basically be doing back to back bursts. I'm gonna be sticking with Plasma Stroke. Wait, actually, at the rate this is going, I think I need to wait for them to do Sandstorm. Cause I think they do it at 70%. Because then we'll have too many buffs clogging up, uh, and there won't be room for Ace's traps. So it looks like I actually have to wait. I think I just need to force one of them below it, though. Yep, there it is. Are they all going to do it? Oh, no, they're not. Okay. That is important to know. Uh, okay, that one has more HP. 70, 71... There's one more sandstorm, and now I'm just waiting on B. Oh yeah, yeah, she nullified the damage from that. And in hindsight, it was also a good play because uh, I could prevent the HP damage from the battery. So, uh, good job me, I guess. And sandstorm number three. Oh wait, I still gotta actually dispel the buffs. So close. Alright, please tell me this is a full dispel, because I don't actually use Beatrix a lot. Okay, good. Okay, so for sure on Beatrix's next turn, I'm bringing in the twins. And come on, Ace, jump up. Excellent. Uh, 
would this be looking like? 2000 attacking Beatrix. Uh, you know, I'm gonna stall this out a bit actually. Hit him with the Delta Arts. Come on, buddy. There you go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's enough room for Ace. Man, I do like whatever this thing is. I like how it looks. Still not gonna green them, though. Alright, so when I originally completed this, I didn't bring a uh, green twins friend. They were base BT, and they were still, they still did monstrous damage. Okay. Fiora's at one and one. Two stacks. And you are at max from the looks of it. Okay. Now seems like a good time to do this. <sighs> I also do like the music, even if it is the basic battle theme. Not that you guys can hear it, unfortunately. Okay, gotta remember, I am with base Ace BT. Damn. Okay, that's one... Hit them with trap number two. Uh, how many turns is on this card? Four turns? Alright, honestly, I'm pretty sure it's better to just use a skill one. Oh yeah, that was definitely the thing to do. <clears throat> wow, 4.2 million, okay. Uh, they're going to be attacking land and run, but I'm sure it's fine. Oh yeah, that counters melee attack, so uh, let me hit him with Blitz Shear. Because that is a magic attack. Man, it's been a while since I've used Dash. It would have been nice if he gotten more, but eh, at least he can do something like this. I mean, he's definitely not doing a lot on his own turns, but he is giving the team a weakness damage boost just by, like, existing, so that is handy. Okay, well, time to devastate these guys, then. Actually, no, not yet. Let me just see what this Mega Flare does. Uh, because the HP cap only goes higher with Ace, uh, with Ace's BT effect. Dear God. I got three more of those. Okay, missed the twins, which is excellent. Oh yeah, the HP uh, damage limit here is really high, like, that high. <laughs> so I should be fine. And I think they're going to do one more Sandstorm at a 20%. Man, that was just a scattered shot of thoughts back there, huh? Oh, good thing Beatrix has Rose Petals, because I was about to say, I have to actually do weakness, you have to do weakness damage, you can't just deal thunder damage, you have to do weakness damage. Uh, but the nice thing about Beatrix is she leaves a framed, uh, framed thunder to, thunder and para. I'll just say that. Uh, 
Oh my god. <laughs> Quicksand, that's just an HP poison effect for us on the field. All three of them are doing it, which is uh, kind of redundant, but whatever. Oh yeah, he's dying. Uh, Dash, do you need to LD again? You've got some buffs running low there. Yes, you do. But those can wait. Damn. Uh, that's what Dush was doing. <laughs> All I can say to these ant lions is good luck, y'all. That middle one was at 26%. Just, just a little fun fact. Uh, did I do Echo Electric 4 actually? No? Cool. Oh, yuck. That's very convenient. <laughs> Just how it's breaking in uh, the exact order. Okay. So this is dropping to 5%, if I, if I remember right. Oh my god. Twins' friends are insane. Or at least in this specific fight, almost engineered to make them look good. Alright, I know what they're gonna do. They're gonna put up their little sandstorm, but Yeah, I don't I wanna make sure all the buffs fit on them. Why didn't that do anything to Oh, he's already at one HP. <laughs> That's why I didn't do anything to him. Fifty thousand. Oh that's the limit, okay. I still have his B... This is insane. Okay, there was a huge difference between base BT twins friend and uh, green twins friend. Wow, okay. That was ridiculous. And I burned up all of those hastily. I don't know what these buffs are, so it's mildly stressful. All right, hang on. One. Oh yeah, I'm also conveniently dealing damage to them. Do they enrage at all? I sure hope not. Plasma Stroke. That's some nice healing. Oh my god, I still have like a whole jackpot triad on deck. Ooh, wait. How much HP do I got? Okay, let me see if I can uh, end this in style. It's either that or I'm just being way too cocky about this. Yeah, being cocky. 
I should have done the Eggbot shop, but whatever. Nice. I didn't need to do that. Uh, I could have just gone for the safe route, but whatever. Now it's time to cook those ant lions with the orig 11 original herbs and spices. And if you don't get that, you should read the intertwining wills. It was kind of cute. All right. Yeah, that does it for this one. Uh, what the heck is next? The boss rush? Let me see if my phone can handle that, but if it can, I will see you for that. So, uh, goodbye for now.